Hi Cancer, this is Jennifer from Soul Source Tarot and I'm here to do your weekly love reading for November 20th through November 26th. This is intended to be a love reading. We will see what comes up. I have pre-shuffled this deck so we're only going to do it for a moment. And I wanted to uh, let you guys know that this is not a private reading so it may not resonate with you. It may or it may not. I will zoom this in here in just a moment, and this is for the sign of Cancer. All right, the basis of your reading, reading is the Knight of Swords. Right next to that, we have the Knight of Cups. So you guys are definitely taking some action. You're not just sitting back waiting for things to happen. You're taking some kind of action. And it looks like you're, you're heading towards something new. All right, you're heading towards something new. Letting go of something that was holding you back. Yeah, you're like alive. It's like, I'm alive. You know, I feel like there's a lot of, you know, you're moving, you're moving on, you're moving, okay? Yeah, it's like you guys are moving forward. You're feeling very, very good. Moving towards love, many of you. Loving somebody more than you thought, perhaps? I'm not sure. But you're definitely, you are accepting, accepting something, and it has to do with love. You're letting go of depression and despair, and you're feeling alive. You know, it looks really good. I think you're, you're really planning for the future, you're thinking about the future, and you're moving forward. You're letting go of some kind of obsession, okay? Congratulations, something that you were obsessed with. I think you're letting go of it. You're taking a practical approach, and I think that I see a lot of happiness here. I see an alignment of some sort, you know? I, I think you've let go of your woes. You know what I mean? It's like, you know, I'm going to let go of this depression. I think if you were feeling depressed or you were feeling sad this week, I, th I don't think that's the case. Okay? I think that you've worked on mastering your emotions and you really have. And because, that, because you have done that, I feel like, you know, there's, be there's like love heals. Love heals. And I think that there's love this week. There's a beautiful union between you and another person. You know, you love heals. I mean, this is a, this is really really good, Cancer. You've just you feel more alive this week than you have in a while. Okay, that's what I see. It looks really good. Um, you're taking action. Things are no longer at a standstill. Perhaps you're offering love to somebody. Um, more prominently than you had in the past you're feeling comfortable doing it like you're ready you're ready to just profess your love to somebody and you plan on showing it to them and I think there's probably a beautiful union between you and another person okay if you're single certainly there could be a love interest that comes in this week we have Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn, we have Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio, we have Libra, Gemini, Aquarius, and we have a Leo here. So we have multiple signs, but I see that many of you, this is a week of feeling alive. No more crying over anything. It's like, I am happy, this is wonderful, and it's just a very positive week. I like it a lot. I'm going to start shuffling this next deck. It feels like you guys are kind of like accepting the truth, no longer denying the truth, you're accepting the truth, okay? Um, no fear. The fear's gone. This is a week of, you know, I'm moving forward and I'm not going to worry. It's 
beautiful. Yeah, it is. So Cancer, I think it's you're feeling like celebrating. You are. You're probably feeling like maybe hanging out with some friends, going out, having some fun. It feels like um, you're just leaving any negativity to behind. You are, um, you're going with the flow. You're just going with the flow. It's wonderful. Okay? Maybe there's a less impulsiveness than there was in the past. You're going with the flow. It feels like there's no need to hurry. You're slowing down. I'm going to take it one day at a time. And I'm very happy with where we're at. You know? It just looks really good. Like, because you're de you've decided to slow down... You've decided to go with the flow and let go. You're being offered a new security. Maybe you're starting to feel more secure in a relationship or more secure with yourself. I feel like this week you're just feeling alive. You're feeling happy. You feel like celebrating, offering love. And there's love. There's love here, and I, it's going. You know, I think that there's a beautiful union between you and another person. There could be a soulmate in your life right now. If not, they could be coming in. But I see absolute happiness here, going with the flow, not trying to rush, not trying to push it. And because you're doing that, you're manifesting positive. You're manifesting security. You're manifesting stability. You feel alive. This is a week of feeling alive. And happy. And celebration. Oh my goodness. Take a look at that. Thank you, Lord, angels, spirits, and universe. I love it when they do this. I really do. This is what's going on. It is a playful, loving, happy week. Oh, my goodness. I got, I have goosebumps now. Place Playfulness. To recapture romance, allow your inner youthful spirit of fun to shine. And that is exactly what's going on. That is. Be honest with yourself, and you are. You are. Look into your heart, and you will know the truth of this situation. It's love. It's safe to admit the truth to yourself, for we will support and guide you through any necessary changes. Lean upon us for courage and the strength to take care of yourself. Focus only upon your true desires, and they'll come to you upon angels' wings if you don't have anybody, love yourself fully and it will come. You will manifest this, this next person, this unexpected love that could come into your life if you are single. Okay? If you don't have anybody coming in, love yourself and you will manifest. Okay? Don't try to push it. Don't try to rush. If maybe you need to go out to a, some kind of celebration and be playful. Maybe you meet this unexpected love that comes into your life at a celebration. Be open to it. Go with the flow. Let your liveliness shine. Be playful. Have fun. So Cancer, this is for November 20th through November 26th, and this is Jennifer from Soul Source Tarot. If you want to know more about me, you can watch my welcome video. And if you are in America, I want to wish you a very happy Thanksgiving.